two months on the job, and the acting superintendent of JCPS returned to West Louisville tonight, where his Jefferson County school career actually began. Marty Polio met with West Louisville leaders, explaining his vision for the district and answering questions and concerns. 11 at 11's Anna Rivera was there with more on what he said. Anna? That's right, Doug. The achievement gap to busing. No topic was off the table. Dr. Polio made it clear he knows the problems facing JCPS, and he's ready to take them head on with help from parents in the West End. It looks and sounds like a church service. But sitting in the pews, a very special guest. Father, we thank you for the superintendent that's present. Interim superintendent Dr. Marty Polio started his JCPS teaching career 20 years ago at Shawnee High School. Now he's returning to West Louisville, promising parents to serve their children. So whatever time period that is that I'm superintendent, whether it be six months, nine months, or multiple years, that I will give everything I have to the kids of Jefferson County and the families of Jefferson County. Dr. Polio acknowledges a major nationwide achievement gap that exists also in JCPS, separating white privileged kids from minority kids in poverty. But he said the district would work to fix those gaps. We have to find ways to get our experienced and high quality teachers in our schools um, where we have high concentrations of poverty. A recent hot topic, the student assignment plan, something Dr. Polio says the district and communities will continue to work on for the next year to a year and a half. I do not believe it is an issue for our state legislature to, to decide. I don't believe that politicians who are all out in the state of Kentucky mm -hmm. should be telling people in Jefferson County right. where their kids That's should go right. to school. Parents and community leaders took time to ask questions, creating an open discussion that left parents satisfied. It lets me know not only that I care, but somebody else cares that's in the school system. And Dr. Polio just yesterday met with state leaders and addressed his goals and concerns about the student assignment plan. It hasn't been reviewed in 10 years. He says he hopes that students, teachers, and parents will be able to decide how to fix that plan to better serve our communities instead of the state stepping in. Anna Rivera, 11 at 11.